Hi everyone, Monique here, Little Gems Creations 1. Today we are going to be working on a washcloth. Now I'm using these washcloths as part of a Christmas, yes, it's still Christmas where I am, as part of a Christmas spa set. So I'm going to show you what I'm doing. And we're going to start that in just a moment. everyone, Monique here, Little Gems Creations 1. Today we are be working on a bean stitch washcloth. You're going to need your crochet hook. I am using a 5 millimeter crochet hook. You're going to need your 100% cotton. I buy these large balls of cotton from Walmart. It's a brunette handicrafter cotton. And it is medium weight four ply okay you're also going to need a pair of scissors okay so let's get started i'm going to put just so you know this is not my pattern i am going to put that pattern in the description below so it's a pinterest it's a pattern i got off pinterest so I'm going to do my best to get you to the pattern, but it's one of those patterns that you have to go through 47 different sites to get to the actual pattern. So I think I've copied the exact link, um, which I will put in the description. But if not, I tried, and I'm basically going to tell you how to do it here. It's just if you want a written pattern, you're going to have to go on Pinterest. So we start by crossing our yarn. And then we're going to chain 30, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Okay, so we've got our 30 chains. Now we are going to do a half double crochet. So we're going to do yarn over our hook. We're going to skip first two chains and go into that third chain, okay? And we're going to do a half double crochet. So we pulled our yarn through, yarn over, and go through all three loops. That's a half double crochet. So let's do it again. Yarn over, into that chain, pull through, yarn over, go through all three loops. One more time, yarn over, into the chain, pull through, yarn over, go through all three loops. Do that to the end of the row and meet me back. Okay, I'm at my last chain here. And so what I, I wanna show you what I do. So yarn over into the loop, but you see how I have my tail here? I just wanna catch it. So I put it over my hook, grab my yarn, pull through, and see I'm just catching that tail so I give it a bit of an extra anchor, okay? So now we're gonna chain up two and go to our next row. Turn your work, and we're going to do seven half double crochets in the stitch stitches, okay? So one, two, we're doing one stitch in each stitch, three, four, five, six, Seven. Okay, so now we're going to do our first bean stitch. Now I'm going to show you how I do my bean stitches, but you might do it differently, and that's okay. The main thing is you're putting in a bean stitch, okay? So for my bean stitch, I go into the stitch, pull a loop through, yarn over. So that's once, pull through, that's twice. This is all in the same stitch. That's three times. And then I do it four times. Yarn over and go through all that mess. And then chain one. Now, 
Our next stitch we're going to skip and then we're going to do another bean stitch in the stitch after that. So you go into the stitch, pull a big loop, yarn over into the same stitch, pull a big loop, yarn over into the same stitch, pull. We're on three big loops, yarn over into the same stitch. We're doing our fourth big loop, okay? Yarn over and go through all that mess. Chain one. Skip the next stitch and then start again. Another bean stitch. Pull through, big loop, yarn over, big loop, two, three big loops, and four big loops. Yarn over, go through the whole mess, chain one, and then skip. We're doing seven bean stitches just like this. Two, three big loops, four big loops, yarn over through the whole mess, chain one, skip one, one, two, three, and four, yarn over, go through the whole mess, chain one. So let's see, right now we have one, two, three, four, five bean stitches. We want seven total, okay? So skip one, one big loop, two big loops, three big loops, four big loops, yarn over, go through the whole mess, chain one, skip one, one big loop, two big loops, three big loops, four big loops, yarn over, go through the whole mess, chain one, so let's count. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bean stitches. We're gonna skip one. And now we're gonna do seven half double crochets to the end of the row. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, six, and seven. Okay, we're gonna chain up two, turn our work, and we're just doing half double crochets all the way across, which will give us 28 half double crochets. And then meet me back. So I've done my 28 half double crochets across. I'm gonna chain two. And just like our other feature row, we're going to do seven half double crochets. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And if you look, you should see that you're bean stitches start here so we're gonna do a bean stitch so into the stitch pull a big loop yarn over second big loop yarn over third big loop yarn over fourth big loop pull through the whole mess and chain one skip one and you're right into another bean stitch big loop yarn over second big loop yarn over third big loop yarn over fourth big loop yarn over and go through the whole mess chain one so again you're doing seven bean stitches with skipping one in between so we've got two okay so then in big loop big loop big loop big loop and then go through the whole mess chain one and then we're going to change the pattern a bit after this. So our next row, we're going to start making the bean stitches on the side, okay? So seven bean stitches, and then you're going to end off with seven half double crochets to complete this row. Then meet me back. Okay, so we're done the bottom of our washcloth. Okay, so now we're going to start the center. So we're going to chain up two, turn our work. So here's the new thing you got to remember. We're going to do 
one half double crochet in that first stitch. Then we're going right into a bean stitch. Okay, so one, two, three, and four. Yarn over, go through the whole mess, chain one, skip one. Then we're gonna do two half double crochets. One, two, and then we're gonna go right into another bean stitch. One, two, three, four, and then go through the whole mess, chain one, skip one. Now we're gonna do 14 half double crochets across. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and fourteen. Okay, so now we're going into a bean stitch. So, one, two, three, and four. Then we're going through the whole mess, chain one, skip one. We're doing two half double crochets in a row. One, two, and then we're going into another bean stitch. So one big loop, two big loops, three big loops, four big loops, and then go through the whole mess, chain one, skip one, and we're ending with one half double crochet. Okay, and now we're gonna just keep doing this until we have 11, on, on the sides we have 11 bean stitches. So I'm gonna show you the next row right away. So we chain up two, turn our work. We're doing a half double crochet to start in that first stitch. Then we're going right into a bean stitch. So we're doing a bean stitch right on top of another bean stitch. One big loop two big loops, three big loops, four big loops, go through the whole mess, chain one, skip one, which is going to be like a long stitch here from your other bean stitch. And then we're going to do two half double crochets, one, two, and those should sit right on top of the two from the previous row. Then we're going right into a bean stitch one big loop two big loops three big loops four big loops go through all mess chain one skip one again it's that long stitch here then we're gonna go into 14 half double crochets okay one two three four five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 14 and then we're going into a bean stitch one big loop two big loops three big loops four big loops yarn over through all that mess chain one skip one two half double crochets one two oops Two, and then into a bean stitch, one big loop, two, three, four, and then go through all of that mess, chain one, 
skip one and then you're ending up with just a single half double crochet okay so this is what you've got now i want you to look over here so see your bean stitches are sitting right on top of each other i don't know if you can see that very well let me zoom in see how the bean stitches are sitting right on top but you've got nothing underneath okay you're gonna keep doing this same row so one bean stitch, two bean stitch, 14 bean stitch, two bean stitch, one. You're gonna do this until you have 11 bean stitches um, sitting on top of each other. And then meet me back. Okay, so I have done 11 bean stitches up the side, okay? So just count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, so now I'm chaining up two, and now we've got to recreate those first two rows. So we're gonna do seven half double crochets one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. Okay, then we're going right into a bean stitch. Okay, so big loop, yarn over, big loop, yarn over, big loop, yarn over, big loop, yarn over, and go through the whole mess. Chain one, skip one, and we're right into another bean stitch. We're doing seven bean stitches with skip ones. Two, three, four, and then go through the mess. Chain one, skip one. One, two, three, four. Go through the mess, chain one, skip one, big loop, one, two, three, four, through the mess, chain one, skip one, one, two, three, and four, chain one, skip one, one, two, three, four, go through the mess, chain one, skip one, one, two, three, <coughs> four, go through the mess, chain one, skip one, and now we're doing seven half double crochets across. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then our next row. So we're gonna chain up two, turn our work, and our next row is just 28 half double crochets across. Then we'll do another row with the seven bean, and then another row of half double crochets, and then you're done. So 28 half double crochets, meet me back. I will do the row with the bean stitches if you just need another refresher. And then we're done. So if you haven't had a chance, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe. And tell me in the comments what you think of this. And if you do your bean stitch differently, because I know some people do, tell me how many loops you do in your bean stitch. Because I think some, I've had some um, patterns that called for five loops, like of the big loops. Anyway, tell me in the comments and let me know. So do 28 half double crochets and then meet me back. So I've done my 28 half double crochets. I'm gonna chain two and turn my work. So 
seven half double crochets. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And then you see below we have our bean stitch, so we can go right into our bean stitch. So one loop, two loops, three loops, four loops, go through the whole mess, chain one, skip one, right into another bean stitch. You want a total of seven bean stitches on this row. Two, go through all the mess. Chain one, skip one, one big loop, two big loops, three big loops, four big loops, go through the whole mess. Um, also, I will put a link in the description for my Etsy store because this is not my pattern, so you won't find it there. Um, but I do have other patterns to some of my other videos, so you can go check out my patterns. I try and keep the prices low, $2 or so. I think the most expensive one is $3. I mean, of course, prices will change with inflation, but yeah. So it's something new I've started doing is writing out the patterns for the ones I create. This is not my pattern. This is someone else's pattern, but I will like I said, put a link for this pattern in the description. It's a free pattern I found on Pinterest. Um, one of the things you do have to do is go through all the sites to get to where you actually want to go. But, okay, so I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I'm going to still skip one, and then I'm doing my seven double crochets to the end. Yeah, and I will put a link to my Pinterest boards in the description as well. So you can go and check out the different links I have. I have also a jewelry Etsy store, so you can go and check out that. And I have links to other people's patterns on my Pinterest boards. Because, you know, I just love crocheting. Okay, so I did my chain up two. And now I'm going to finish this with a row of 28 half double crochets. And then, guys, all you have to do is if you want, you can hide your threads. Honestly, I just give them a snip. I leave like a half inch and I give it a snip and I leave like I don't hide the ends because... Honestly, I hate hiding ends. And that's all there is to this washcloth. I'm using this as part of a spa set. It also can be used as a dishcloth. Um, you know, some people use them as hot pads. Now, it's not very thick, but you could make two and sew them together to make a hot pad. Whatever, use your creativity. I'm here to inspire. So thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Bye now.